Uh, what to start? You're just placing them in any way you wanted in the early stages of that. Yeah, you, you get things like that. I mean, um, they were doing that for the last hour in practice, so uh, I was just hoping that, that it would carry on up there, and it did. Unfortunately, I lost it a little bit and allowed him back into the match. In fact, it carried on. I think that might have been 3-0, but well, who knows? The wonders of set play, even when you're dominating for large periods, you can suddenly go, hang on, he's drawn level here. Mm. It's a dangerous game, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, and Max is a dangerous player. I mean, he, he's, um, he can play the game, and he can play the game to a very good standard. So, uh, you know, you, you can't really afford to, to let him back in, which I've done. Nearly paid the price. You come here to this William Hill World Championship, having just made another major final. A couple of months ago, you were genuinely concerned about where your form was and what you were going to achieve. Once again, you can turn things around. No, I, I think other people were more concerned about my form and, and writing me off and things like that. I've always believed, um, even though things, you know, when they, they don't go, I, I'm still practising well. So it's, uh, yeah, I think other people have been more worried about my, my lack of form than myself. Has your attitude changed at all this year? Obviously, you've gone back to work this year. You've, you've sort of, you've, is it just less intensive, the whole sort of dance life, and it's brought a different approach to it? No, um, I still practice the same. I still practice the same amount of hours. Um, and my intensity when I practice and when I play is, is very much the same. Um, yes, I went back to work because we, we had no darts. So, and I'm not one to sit on my backside doing nothing, twiddling my thumbs. I get bored very easily. Um, and there's only so much golf and only so much fishing you can do. So I said to Tracy, I'm going to go back to work. She went, we're all right, aren't we? I said, yeah, we're fine. We're, we're absolutely fine. I said, but I am not going to sit on my backside doing nothing. I've got to do something. So she went, OK, let's redo the kitchen. So I'd done that and decorated. And I went, no, I'm going back to work. She went, OK. So that's why. I, I, I can't sit there doing nothing. I get bored very quickly. Back to the proper stuff now, though. the William Hill World Championship, mm. taking on the Grand Slam champion in the next round. But the way you're playing, the way he's been playing this year, could be at fireworks. Um, could well be. Who knows? You've seen plenty of players come and go in your time. You're one of the stalwarts of this sport. Are you saying I'm old? Yeah, I am. Yeah, yeah. pretty much, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I thought you were. Yeah. But has it surprised you how Joe said his house has almost come from nowhere? To he hasn't come from nowhere. He hasn't. He's He's been doing it on the... On the floor tournaments, and he's gradually been getting better and better and better and going up. And everyone that watches him play does not want to play him, me included. But I've got no choice. I've got to play him. So he's getting everything I've got, and if it's enough, happy days. If it isn't, well, there you go. Well done, Thank you. Murph, we saw you up there with a real smile on your face, as if you were really enjoying it. Is this the most you've enjoyed darts for a while? Um, I actually started to enjoy the game again about... 18 months ago, um, I, w I went through, I wouldn't say the doldrums, not, not through form, but oh, I've got to go and stay away from home again. Um, and because we play so much, it, it was, I'll sleep in another hotel bed and I'll stay away from home again. And, and it really, really does get to you. You know, everyone thinks, oh, you're living the dream and, and all this. Just try it for six months and see how you like it. You know, I mean, it's not just the players. It's all the guys that do the rigging and, and everything else that's involved with a major tournament. It's not just the players. So, yeah, I'm, I'm enjoying the game again. And because of that, I think I'm now getting some results. Changing back to set play, is that a mentality shift as well? Obviously, because you can have little off periods in these games, can't you, during the set play, where leg play is intense. We, we try not to. <laughs> um, I don't really think about it, to be honest with you. I go up there and try to win every single leg I play in. So um, I want to go 3-0, 3-0, 3-0. And, and that's it. That's what I try and do. Obviously, that's a perfect world. It doesn't happen like that. You, you're not going to win every single leg. We saw you in the Players' Championship final. Not too happy with Michael's celebrations. Was that nice to play in a game? that didn't have it and do you think players are over, not just Michael but in general, are over celebrating too much? No. Yes I do, um, to be fair, I, I can understand the celebrations at a pivotal time of the game, a big shot and, and maybe break somebody to um, win that set or, or, or break someone's throw to give yourself a, a chance to, to win the match, um, a 170 or something like that, but when 
you're you're screaming and shouting the place down just because you've hit double eight and it's just one you another leg and there's still miles to go um that doesn't bode well with me um it's it's over reacting it's over celebrating um but there you go it's it's that's my opinion on it that's the way i feel other players will be different Merv, congratulations and pleasure always. thank you thank you Merv, i remember speaking to you at the, the world grand prix and you said the new setup is a setup that you believe you can win the world championship with do you still believe that um i didn't say the setup then was um i said the darts um the setup has changed because i i, I thought that the actual setup with the new darts wasn't quite right they they were flying nicely but not quite as well as I wanted them to and I've messed about with stems and flights and, and I've gone through a longer point but gone back to my original stems and flights and they feel absolutely fantastic so yes I believe that is the setup if I can just get rid of those foo legs where I I don't hit a lot um, and just carry on at the the ton plus average, then yes, what, why shouldn't I win the world? Um, yeah, a lot of people are saying I'm too old and, and all this, but hey, you're, you're only as good as your next game. It's the, the ones that you've thrown are, have gone. You, you can't take anything really from them. It, you know, it's, it's what you've got to play. I know it's something you've, you've talked extensively about going back to work, but does that take a bit of the, the pressure off financially knowing that you've got something there was else? No, there was no pressure financially. Okay. Um, it, as I said, it's, I, I don't want to sit on my backside doing nothing. I get bored very easily, and that's the reason I went back to work.